The Texas State football team suffered its second consecutive loss this season Saturday against Nichols State. The Bobcats lost 47-45 to in quadruple overtime to go 3-3 three and -three on the season and 0-2 and in conference play. Texas State quarterback Tyler Arndt had the best game for a Bobcat freshman with 348 passing yards and 25 for 39 pass completions. Senior wide receiver Demarcus Griggs had a career best game with 11 receptions and 205 yards for two touchdowns. However, Texas State's offensive performance came up short in its second conference loss of the season. The Colonels were first to score in the first quarter with an eight yard touchdown run by quarterback LaQuinton Caston. Texas State answered back with a touchdown by Griggs in the second quarter to tie the game at seven going into halftime. One of the Bobcats' costly errors came in the third quarter when kicker Justin Gerlich missed a 35-yard field goal that was returned 70 yards for a touchdown, giving Nickel State the 14-7 advantage. Junior wide receiver Darren Diller tied the game at 14 with a touchdown with just over three minutes left to play in the third. Griggs recorded another touchdown in the fourth to take the lead 21-14, but the Colonels scored with less than 13 seconds left in the game to go into overtime. The Bobcats and Colonels traded scores in the four overtime periods, but the game ultimately came down to Texas State being unable to convert the needed two-point conversion in the final overtime. The Bobcats are now ranked last in the Southland Conference standings and face Northwestern State in their homecoming game at 3 p.m. Saturday at Bobcat Stadium. This is Lisa Carter, the sports editor with the University Star.